the question is a man woman and a child can do a work in 6 days if the man can do it in 24 days or the woman can do it in 16 days how long will it take the child how long will the child take to do it alone so this is a quantitative aptitude question on time and work is a quantitative aptitude question on time and work or work done concept so what happens is whenever you get questions on time and work try to convert it as work done in a single unit work done in a single unit see for example suppose i can do a work in 10 days suppose i can do a work in 10 days or i can complete a work in 10 days so find out what i will do in one day find out what i will do in one day so one day work will be 1 by 10 as simple as this. one day work will be 1 by 10 find out what one person can do in one day whenever this different days always consider work done in one day sometimes work done concept also can in manual days then you'll have to bother about man days woman days and machine days but in this question find out what you can do in one day here what will happen is a man can do a work in 24 days so if a man can do a work in 24 days so he'll complete the work in 24 days he requests to complete work in 24 days so in one day he will do the output will be 1 by 24 in one day he will do 1 by 24 a woman can do the work in a woman can do the work in 16 days So in one day she will do one by sixteen. In one day she will do one by sixteen. Child we do not know. Child we do not. This is what we have to find out. Child we have to find out. So because I have taken this as x days, in one day the child will do one by x. In one day the child will do one by x. And what is given is they combine to do the work in six days. See man plus woman plus child. Man plus woman plus child they can do it in six days means. In one day they will do one by six. In one day they will do one by six. Man plus woman plus child can do it in six days. Output will be six days. So this will be one by six. Now let us solve this. What happens is because this is output in one day by a man, output in one day by a woman, output in one day by a child. This is what is the combined output for all the three put put together in one day. So one by twenty four plus one by sixteen plus 1 by x will be equal to 1 by 6. 1 by 24 plus 1 by 16 plus 1 by x will be equal to 1 by 6. Now finding out LCMs, all this, so uh, this is required. What happens is the easier way of doing it is take the variables to one side, numbers to one side. It will be easier. Don't unnecessarily create the LCM for x also. It will create problems. It will you will do more work. So take all the numbers to one side and let the variable remain here itself. That is the easier way of doing it. So one by x will be equal to one by six minus one by twenty-four minus one by sixteen. One by x will be equal to one by six minus one by twenty-four minus one by sixteen. So let us find out the LCM of six twenty-four and sixteen. The LCM will be ninety-six. For those who are not clear about finding LCMs, this will be done like this: six twenty-four and sixteen. So divide it by two. Divide it by two. This will become three. This will be twelve, and this will be eight. Now this three is a prime number. Nothing can be done to this. So divide this by four because this both are divisible by four. So I can do it by two or by four because both are divisible by four. I take it as four. So three, three, and this will be two. Again because three is common, divide by three. This will be one, one and two. Now nothing can be done here. So it's two into four, eight. Eight into three, twenty-four. Twenty-four into two is forty-eight. The LCM is forty-eight. 2 into 4, 8. 8 to the 24. 24 to 2 is 48. So the LCM is 48. So 1 by x will be equal to 48 is the LCM. 8 minus 2 minus 3 will be 3 by 48, which will be equal to 1 by 1 by x will be equal to 1 by 16. So x will be equal to 16. 1 by x will be equal to 1 by 16. This is the easier way of doing it. Even just by saying it, we have got the LCM. So if you are not clear, this is the LCM working is like this. So x one by x will be one by sixteen. The answer is the child alone can do it in sixteen days. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then.